Good morning, Rosie. Welcome and thank you for joining me at Defunk. Good morning, Lee. Thanks for inviting me. It's great to be here. Wonderful. Rosie, tell me, you are the dealer principal at Naval Ford in Paul in Cape Town. You've been the dealer principal for the last five years. Yes, that's correct. Wonderful. And tell me, it's such an honor for me to chat with you this morning. And I know there's a couple of things that make your dealership very special. But firstly, I wanted to find out from you, what is it like working at your specific dealership? And what is it like working with the team? Well, um, working in Paul and um, being a rural area, it's, it's really beautiful. We have beautiful surroundings. Um, working with the team, um, we are a diverse and dynamic team. And we're very customer centric. So we try and offer our customer the best experience we possibly can. Mm -hmm. And yes, yeah, so it's a, it's a great pleasure to work here. And tell me your role as, as dealer principal. Tell me a little bit more about what it is that you do and what you take care of. Well, basically, um, my role is to look after the interests of the stakeholders in the business. So I need to look after the profitability and the productivity. Um, I need to make sure that the staff are happy and engaged and also customer centric. Um, yeah, so basically looking after the dealership as a whole. Great. And there's a very special part of the history or how the dealership actually started. Would you mind sharing with our listeners a bit about the history of the dealership in Paul? Um, yes, yeah, sure. Um, the dealership was started in um, 1986 by two local families, um, the Zubentimes and the, and the Reposers, and they sold the business to uh, McCarthy Bidvest in um, December 2017. So that was how, the, how Bidvest came to, to own this um, dealership. Wonderful. And tell me, um, I believe your team that you work with is really amazing and that you, as a dealership, actually do some really amazing community work and initiatives as well. Would you mind sharing a little bit more about that with us? Yes, so um, Noble Ford have sponsored um, Paul Chum, which is a school here in Paul, um, for many, many years. And we have kept it up, um, kept up the tradition for, um, you know, since Bidvest has taken over. And so we sponsor the sports um, section with a, a vehicle and they currently have a, a Ford Ranger. And yeah, so it's very exciting because every year we have a, um, there's an annual derby which takes place between, um, between Paul Boys High and um, Paul Chum. And um, it draws a lot of people into the Paul area, tens yes. of thousands of people. Yes. And so that's one of the um, one of the schools that we support. Um, then we also support a um, a, a um, NGO called Casper, which is yes. um, a um, street people um, organization. Yes. So we support them financially by helping them with their soup kitchens. And um, we also sponsor um, Lampo School. It's one of the biggest um, agricultural schools in South Africa. I think it's wow. three of the, three, one of the three biggest. Yes. And um, we also sponsor them with a the vehicle and it gives us a lot of marketing opportunity, mm. you know, both of the schools to be a part of the events. Yes. yes, that's wonderful, Rosie. That's really, really great. And well done to you and the team. And it definitely sounds like a very special dealership and a bunch of people to actually work with. So well done on that. And Rosie, before we end off, and thank you for your time this morning. It really has been wonderful chatting to you. There is something really, really special going on there with you and your team and your dealership with regards to a certain Mustang. Do you want to, to tell our readers about that? <laughs> yes, so we acquired the um, Shelby franchise um, in towards the end of last year, and we created our first um, Shelby um, Mustang in beginning of 2022. Yes. And we are, um, it's a very exciting initiative because it brings a lot of excitement into the dealership. You know, yes. when you start up a Mustang on the floor, that noise <laughs> is just so um, super exciting. 
So um, now we are doing our, we're doing our second um, Shelby now coming up. And then towards the end of um, this year, we're going to be doing a Speedster, uh, okay. which is a convertible. So that's also very exciting. We've ordered the car, waiting for it to arrive in November. And um, yeah, so that will be our sort of final project for the year. Wonderful. I wish I could be in the poll area at that time of year to come for a <laughs> test drive. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you're welcome. Oh, thanks, Rosie. Rosie, thank you so much again for your time. It really has been great talking to you. And I cannot wait for this feature in, in this magazine. Um, also about, about your, your Shelby Mustang. I just think that it's going to be phenomenal. Thank you so much, Rosie. I really appreciate it. Keep well. Okay. Only a pleasure. Thank you, Lee. Take care. Bye. Bye.